Hey, what is going on guys? And today I'm going to show you guys a plugin called OP Security. So this is a really good anti-grief plugin and a really good anti-hacks plugin. So, unfortunately, for the most part of this plugin tutorial, I won't be able to show you guys how the plugin works. I can only tell you guys how it works because I don't I don't have hacks. I'm not a hacker, but I will explain how it works. Basically, it's pretty easy. The plugin checks for a player and makes sure that he has the correct permissions to do what he's doing. So let's say he has a hack that allows him to have creative mode. The plugin will check and make sure to see if he has the permission to be in creative mode. And if he doesn't, then it's going to kick him off the server and possibly ban him, depending on what you set in the config. So that can go with flying. If he doesn't have the permission to fly, you'll automatically read that and kick him. And same with world edit, because there are a lot of hacks that have world edit in them. So it'll check for the permission, make sure that they have the permission to use world edit. And if they don't, then they're banned off the server. So it's a really, really good plugin. And it's probably one of the best that I've ever heard. So, so let's go ahead and hop in the config for this plugin. Make sure to download, drop in your plugins for it, and then restart your server if you want to have some good security on your Minecraft server. All right, so up in the config, here's the setting that we're going to have to change to true once we change everything else. So first, let's hop down to, you can check if he's an op. And if he's an op, then they'll let it go. Or you can just change this to false. So check for perm. That's most important part so you can add the permissions like essentials dot game modes like essentials dot fly we can go ahead and add that if we wanted to okay I messed up there there we go we can add that if we wanted to so essentials dot fly so we'll check to make sure he has this if he's actually using it so if he's using it and he doesn't have this permission he'll get one of the punishments down here of course you can add like the game mode permission and all that good stuff players who bypass the checks you're gonna have to add all your ops you're gonna have to add all your admins here. The op player when banned, um, he probably won't be an op. Ban, that's the most important part. Ban IP, you can kick him. The kick message that is displayed, and you can actually password protect really OP commands like slash op. So if some way a hacker does slash op, then you can actually have a password for it, which is pretty freaking awesome. So the global password is OP swag, which is probably pretty cool I'd, I'd actually leave that and keep that there or you can change it to a player password which the player password is down here for each individual player but that's up to you guys and that's pretty much it for this plugin tutorial so hopefully you guys did enjoy make sure to drop a like subscribe for more and i'll see you guys next time peace out